True Survival has been receiving background updates. If you don't know, True Survival Mode is a comprehensive set of 1.19 databack features that aim to overhaul Minecraft's survival mode. It tackles difficulty and progression through means that don't disrupt Minecraft's regular sandboxy gameplay, while also providing new features that feel closely integrated to the vanilla feel. With that being said, we have a lot of updates, so let's jump into it. So, starting with version 4.1.0, we have changes to Spider Queens. Spider Queens now check the block below them before choosing to place a cobweb. This is so players can have a bit more control over their terrain, as well as their mob farms. The blocks that are valid for spiders to place cobwebs are natural blocks you'll find in the overworld, like stone, grass, and dirt. Other smaller updates include Craving's icons lasting 10 seconds instead of 8 seconds, the guidebook is now fixed to no longer revert settings changes after reloading their world, and bats no longer drop multiple types of seeds in one kill as well as only dropping their items upon a player kill. Moving on to version 4.2.0, we have changes to the soul well. Now when you throw a poppy into the soul well, a new mob, the skull sprite, emerges. Kill it to receive a wither rose and a wither skeleton skull. Now, during the Elder Dragon boss fight, and Derek Geysers spawn and launch you into the air during dragon fights while the end crystals are still present. Unique shields from loot bundles no longer have die lore text, and the chance of unique shields from loot bundles are increased from 25% to 40%. Dragon loot now drops as a barrel falling from the sky onto the bedrock end fountain. Dragon loot will also no longer yield a dragon egg. Silverfish egg and artisan scrap textures have received massive overhauls. Drowns can now be invested in a stronghold. Voyagers now trade campfires for two emeralds. We have greatly reduced the length of the Voyager's glowing effect. Silverfish eggs replace redstone blocks in stronghold loot. Artisan scrap has been added to the woodland mansion and pillager outpost loot tables. Dragon fruit now uses dragon's breath instead of dragon eggs in its custom recipe. We've removed the fishing trophy visible collection advancements. Illusioners in the Elder Dragon fight now have a custom death animation connecting end crystals and enderic geysers. Diamond chestplate and netherite chestplate nerfs have been made slightly less punishing. Sea fragments now use amethyst shard as a base item, as well as fishing trophies now using structure blocks as their base item. Fishing trophies are now disabled by default, and you can re-enable them through the guidebook settings. And to finish it off with version 4.3.0, we've updated True Survival Mode to 1.19. The Warhorn crafting recipe has been changed to use artisan scrap as well as a specific kind of goat horn. The goat horn is also now the base item for the Warhorn, meaning you can play the sound without actually triggering raids. Make sure to like and subscribe, but before we go, let's talk optimization. True Survival Mode has received tons of optimizations, with version 4.2.0 having a massive effect on the efficiency and just general lag friendliness of True Survival Mode. If you're more interested in the code and the technicality of how this all happened, go ahead and visit the changelogs in the description. But I'd also like to take this time to thank Galdavir, a Discord mod on my server, for templating out a massive way of overhauling True Survival's uh, optimization and code, as well as going into specific features and how those can be optimized as well. True Survival Mode is in a better place than it's ever been, almost entirely due to those efforts. So once again, thanks Galdavir, and make sure to go visit his Planet Minecraft page, give his work some love. There's tons of great stuff out there. But make sure to check out Project Riptide, my RPG adventure map that I'm working on as my new main project over True Survival Mode. Thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for playing. Like, subscribe, do all the, the buttons, press them, please. It helps a lot. My name has been Devin, and I will catch you next time. Bye-bye.